Hey guys, hope you're having all a great day. So today I want to talk about a great project, which is Raptorum. It's a secure cryptocurrency and asset platform. So we finally have a decent way to mine on CPU, guys. Uh, what I really like about this coin is that it's uh, it's really like ASIC uh, resistant. So we don't need to buy any more like ASIC or FPGA uh, thick hardware for everybody to, to mine on. That's very expensive. You can mine on this. And this thing has uh, will have smart contract implementation. Uh, so that's oh, that's amazing, uh, you know, where you'll have a smart node scaling and you'll try to avoid the condition issues that you see on Ethereum. And also uh, this will be very flexible because uh, you're going to have programming languages and also they have made protection on to protect themselves from 51% uh, double spend attack. Uh, this is a very secure blockchain and you will have to... Uh, future, you can, you can lock your RTM coins or your asset into a special transaction and have them automatically release at certain block height or time step. So it's a very uh, easy and powerful asset. I do hope uh, many things for this coin. Uh, it's currently trading, I think, if I was not mistaken, at 0 0.43, but I see this uh, going up. So uh, I'll show you real quick how to mine uh, Raptorium. So the first thing you want to go ahead and download a wallet. So once you do that, uh, you go here on this section, you click on, uh, for my case, I have Windows, so Windows 64 uh, setup. So once that, you, you open that, and we want to start the setup on this. So, yeah, we're going to start, VM Core, and we're going to wait a bit for this to install. It's installed next, so now uh, we're going to run it. Um, so we're going to use the default data directory here. We're going to click OK. And we're gonna wait a bit. We're gonna allow access to this. And now it's gonna uh, try to set up uh, the wallet here. This is where we have the Raptorium core. And we'll, while we wait for this, we're gonna go ahead. So now this is the wallet. We're gonna check and download the CPU miner because this is what we're gonna mine on. So they have released the recent hotfix, it seems, 1.241. So we're gonna go ahead, obviously we're gonna download the Windows one here. This is a Windows tutorial. They always say they only try to block it. So uh, let's open this and uh, let's uh, keep the dangerous file, keep it anyway. We're gonna wait for them to install. So uh, you need a program like uh, WinRare into this. Um, so uh, one thing you have to do, make sure here you uh, you export so uh, we're gonna open that and we're gonna export that to the desktop so I'm gonna click it here it's gonna export the desktop here so while here that uh, Rapidium core is uh, sinking we see we're 27 we uh, 27 weeks behind we're not gonna wait on that we can go ahead and still uh, go on receiving addresses we're gonna go copy our address and we're gonna close it we can start mining even if it's not syncing it's fine we just mean we didn't connect to the, all the blockchain and we didn't retrieve all the latest uh, transaction so we copy that and we're gonna go ahead to the cpu minor files that, that you downloaded and we're gonna go ahead to binaries why we're gonna do that because we want to enable a high number of pages if you don't know uh, cpu mining you need to enable a high number of uh, pages and you need to give admin access to get the best uh, number so we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna edit this. I'm using Windows 11 here, but uh, you can edit this uh, with uh, your regular uh, Windows 10. Go ahead and enable admin now. So we're gonna go here on the uh, properties and we're gonna go to compatibility and we're gonna make sure we're gonna run this program as administrator, click apply. We're gonna do the same on the second one. So we're gonna go to properties and uh, make sure we run this as administrator as well. Uh, this will make sure we guarantee we'll get the best throughput of this, the best mining performance. Then we're going to head back to the config here. Uh, we're going to open this. And then you're going to go ahead and make sure you paste here the username with your address that you got from the wallet. And you can name your uh, worker name here. I'm going to name mine AMD CPU for this uh, test. And I'm going to save that. And after that, there's only more to it. We're going to run the, run the CPU miner file. So we're going to click next here. And it says here that we could not load the tune config. However, the huge pages were set up uh, successfully. Uh, I'm not sure why uh, uh, here it's saying field to load the MSR for the CPU. So I'm going to close that again. I'm going to make sure I run this as administrator and see if that fixes the issue. 
So I've run this administrator as well, and that fixed the issue. I really want to have huge pages and MSR set up, as I mentioned. It will increase the performance of the miner. And yeah, we're final mining, guys. So we're having here 990, so 82.52 per thread. So uh, yeah, this is how you mine uh, Raporium, guys. So. Uh, what will happen now again you're gonna mine to uh, this uh, to your wallet that you put i'm using here an amd ryzen 5 3600 six core processor if you have of course a 5900x you're gonna have better performance however for this this is just a tutorial a quick video how to set up Raptorium and get yourself up and running and mine with your wallet so one quick thing guys if you want to get paid make sure you go and you on flockpool.com and you put in your uh, raptor on your address the same one so once you add it here uh, you'll see here your hash rate and everything and uh, it will uh, pop up here while however you're still fine tuning you won't get any results here just give you a heads up however once you do that once you have a minimum payment here uh, they will send you the payment and you can put here the auto update here uh, if you want so if you go in your binary file here just make sure you put here the closest server to you. Uh, for me, it's US. So once you do that, you'll have uh, the best ping and it will be better performance for you. Uh, so once you let your mining running for a bit, uh, once uh, here it says here, the, the tuning will take 222 minutes. So you won't get any results here uh, before. Uh, however, it's not a big deal. And uh, as you can see here, finally, my, uh, my wallet core is sinking. So I'm at 60%. So we will still have, uh, we process 122 blocks of transaction history. So, and uh, once it's all synced up, you'll be all good. However, uh, the miner is uh, already mining. So uh, that's about it, guys, for mining Raptorium on Windows. Please let me know if you have any questions uh, and subscribe. Uh, what do you think? Do you think this coin will be the next big thing in CPU mining? Uh, keep me posted and uh, take care, folks.